Hello, everybody. My name is Mr. Stormcrow, and I hope you guys are having a great holiday. Man, it's it's already Christmas. I, I can't believe it. Time really does fly. But I want to sort of give a little news update or status update, something that I think might interest you. So let me transition into my desktop here. But turns out KFC have their own console. Now, we don't really know like when this is uh, really coming out. I, I think they're going to probably go for next year because obviously it's the end of the year almost but as you can see here they're introducing the kfc console power your hunger and honestly i'm not gonna lie if i had like a good amount of money just to like buy i might even indulge in this um but this thing is pretty much a computer um so if you didn't know it has a core i9 ninth gen which is the cpu and yeah it's looking pretty good um i may have been wrong in the i9 i'll have to look into more information but the well, the main point here is that they actually have a console, and that was really great. I'm going to put a description, or well, I'll put a look at the description if you want to check that out. But I thought this was really cool, and honestly, it's interesting to see how we even have like corporations that are trying to do the console market now. And as much as you want to hate them, they are introducing competition, which a lot of, well, let's just say markets in general don't really do. And I guess it's sort of that necessary evil, so to speak. But uh, it's really great to know that we do have a console on the market, and I'll show you guys the video if you want of this whole um, KFC console if you'd like. They're stacked against us, and it seems like the entire world wants to tell us no. <gasps> That's not possible. Surely that can't be done. And we look oh, up to oh, the stars and oh. say, just watch me. Because what? We know that rules are made to be broken. No way. We know that dreams are made to be followed. <laughs> Look at that stock images. That the impossible is made to be possible. And that gaming consoles are Oh man. Welcome oh. to the next level in gaming innovation. The KF console. The KF console. That's that's what it is. And Cooler Master is actually it's sort of like in a connection with them so this is going to be really interesting to see what they're going to really release for a product but what's really cool the highlight of all this by the way if i didn't really tell you guys is it does have a first built-in chicken chamber i'm not gonna lie kiddos this thing is looking hot no pun intended so again this thing i'm not gonna lie it's really interesting to see how we're joking around and for it to actually be built in engineering wise and i don't know as much as you want to hate kfc you know their food i mean i'm not gonna lie Having having chicken in your computer, I, I feel we're getting next gen. This is the actual cyberpunk, <laughs> not the game. This is it, boys. Um, but again, um, yeah, that's really cool. It's it's really interesting. Um, what we got here. So again, it's got the Intel NUC nine Extreme Compute element, um, which I'm assuming is the CPU. And you see the motherboard right there. I think that's what it looks like. So yeah, that's that's really cool. And um, I don't know if they really talked about the GPU. I couldn't really find it here, but. It's really cool, and it, it looks like you have an M.2 drive, and you got yourself a Seagate HDD, I'm assuming. But honestly, um, yeah, I just wanted to sort of share with you guys that we do have another console in the market to end the console wars. Um, but anyways, I hope you guys had a happy holidays, and I hope you guys are doing well on another note. Man, this year has been quite tough, but at least we had something that at least somewhat saved it, and that is the KF controller, or the KF console. I, I Man, I can't even speak right now, but... Uh, yeah, that's really cool. And it's, yeah, again, 4K. Now that's now that's something in the KF console, I'm not going to lie. But I just thought it was really interesting to bring up, considering that it's almost done with this year. And I guess we wanted to leave it off of a good note. So thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace out.